Peace family, it's your boy Tez, the local financial ninja, coming at you again with some more of these Tez talks. What I want to talk to you guys about today is this book I've been reading called The Four Agreements. It's by Don Miguel Ruiz. It's a classic, so I know a lot of you guys have probably read it already or you've heard about it. If you haven't read it, I highly suggest you check it out. Um, but some of the important things that I took from the book that I really appreciate is this concept of our belief systems, the judge that we have in our mind, and the victim that we have in our mind. So when we're born into this world, we're domesticated through fear, right? So we're socialized into this society based on concepts of fear, which causes us to develop our belief systems. So the, our beliefs come about when we make agreements to those concepts. So say for instance, it's a big popular one. You have to have a job to provide for yourself in order to be a successful person, in order to be happy. So right off the back, I'm not even introduced to the concept of being an entrepreneur. I automatically think that I have to plug into the system to be abundant in my life and to be a successful person and to be happy being able to provide for myself, right? So that's just one main thing I think we're all familiar with. Um, when it talks about the judge in our mind, it's basically this fabricated standard we hold ourselves to in our subconscious. So this perfect image and trying to live up to that standard, which is impossible, creates a battle in yourself, right? And that just grows the fear inside of you, you know? And on the opposite end of that, we have the victim. So it's our inner sense of powerlessness we present in confrontation with others, in confrontation with our beliefs, in confrontation with society's beliefs and our judge. So you know that you can't live up to the perfect standard of the judge that you've created. So you feel powerless and that just compounds your battles that you're fighting inside of yourself. So like it's our mission to understand that and to break away from that, break away from those agreements, you know, so that we can reach a higher level of ourselves, higher level of consciousness and understand that we're not perfect. We do have power over our situations and that as long as you become a warrior in this, a spiritual warrior, that's all you need. Happiness and everything else is going to come. But you got to understand that the victim and the judge, they're not on your side. So thank you guys for tuning in. Peace and love, family.